Me and my friends made a movie in 24 hours, and this is how it went. We're getting B-roll. War at 2.15. We got that flaming hot. Ah. Pay me like one of your friends here. <laughs> yeah. ah, I want to strangle someone. Be like a fireman. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Hey, yo, Frisbee. Come, yes. I have a the challenge was simple. We had 24 hours to make an entire movie from scratch. We didn't have a script, we didn't have anything planned. All we had was a deadline the next day to premiere our movie. Here's the plan, all right? There is no plan. Starting right now at 12.50, we have 24 hours to make an entire movie. Starting now. And after some discussion, we decided that our movie would be a sequel to the critically acclaimed film Morbius. We're making the new Morbius, Morbius, uh, Forbius. We're making Forbius. But let's not get ahead of ourselves, because first I'd like to introduce the cast. We have diversity. This is so great. First we got Mass, our stunt specialist, willing to put the human body on the line and, and climb stuff at random. Uh. Next up is April. Imagine being named after a month. We gotta have some female representation, obviously, unlike the last Johnny Razor original production. And finally, Kai, a very funny guy who also ups our diversity rating. All of them are very funny people that I met through a comedy club that I'm a part of, making them the perfect fit for this job. You know what? You know, let's just let's just say what's gonna happen, and we'll make up the lines as we go. <laughs> yes. Okay, it's not like we met through an improv club or anything. With our powers combined, we got right to work deciding what kind of movie to make. It's a horror movie, and it's like the POV of the killer and he's just like really bad at killing and it's like a mockumentary. I want to be the murderer. Opening scene, opening scene is the killer talking about being a killer. Cut to, we'll cut to a scene of them, of them just stab it. Just, just, just stab it. I mean, I was built to play the stereotypical black character in a horror movie. So you gotta die first. first. Wait, can we have every person that dies be Kai? Can we have like 40, can we have Kai in different outfits die? I brought different outfits! April's, April's the killer in every scene, but then like, Kai is the killer. No! No, 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 they're, it's like, it's following the killer. They do, they don't kill anybody except for like cutaway, like family guy cutaways of them killing people. So so their motive is, is they watched Morbius one time and became the morb. And all of the people they're killing are Morbius fans. Now obviously we had the perfect formula for the perfect movie, but the clock was ticking and we had to get right to work. And now we gotta, we gotta cut to, to filming. Wait, let me, let me do the fun, the fun snap thing where, where we snap and then we're at the place. Uh -huh. We're, we're back in a different location. Isn't with that crazy? With another person. Now there's another person. On the scene, we met up with our final crew member, Amanda, who has the best drip out of anybody at all times. We're gonna figure out uh, how we're actually gonna film this. We have props. Talk about getting ahead. <laughs> <laughs> We briefly explained our schizo meltdown of a plot to Amanda and got right to work. We found several locations that would work and slowly maneuvered ourselves around my college campus to bang this thing out as fast as possible. All right, guys, here's how the scene's gonna go. So April's gonna walk and I'm gonna follow with the camera until I'm off screen and then she's gonna come in and sit down and then you're gonna be like, man, we sure are a bunch of a bunch of guys, right? You're right, you're right, you're right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> the person walked by and looked directly at the camera. <laughs> Also, in our, our great judgment, we decided that the killer would run around in a yellow morph suit the entire time, so it made filming in public um, a little awkward, to say the least. There's people looking at me. If I didn't see the mask from behind, I'd think that's a minion. <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> Filming was going smoothly, and since our plan was pretty minimal, to say the least, we just kind of came up with stuff as we went. <laughs> that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. That's good. Like, no one's Spider-Man kissing him. Go Spider-Man! Yeah, Spider-Man kiss him! For the final scene, we ventured into the woods, like, 20 feet from campus. But it did the job! It was perfect! Hey, yo. Action! Whoa, what was that? I think that's a deer. I'm 
laughing is probably in that take, but it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. With our on-campus scenes finished, we ventured back to where we started to film the mockumentary stuff, along with a few indoor scenes that we missed. The place where we were filming had a miniature theater that we decided to use for a few scenes, which also provided the perfect venue for the premiere of Forbius. So what led you to the morgue? <laughs> <laughs> Around 10 p.m. we were finally done filming, so we celebrated by watching Eddie Burback's Morbius video and going to McDonald's. So so we just watched we just watched Morbius. I wanna strangle someone. Yeah, well we didn't actually watch Morbius, we watched a video about Morbius. And yeah, we did. I feel like I feel like that like I I, I, I got the gist of it. Yeah. I got the gist of it. Yeah, um, vicariously through poor Eddie Burbank. It is 10 o'clock right now, which means yeah. We're not even halfway through our time. I think I think we're gonna we're gonna get this movie done. Yeah. You say we're yeah. gonna get it done. It's all on you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's it's literally it's literally all me. Let's go to McDonald's. Yo, McDonald's! McDonald's! McDonald's. McDonald's. But although everyone else was finished, I still had a lot of work ahead. It is officially 1215 is 1215, which means it is 12 hours into our experiment, into our project. We have all the filming done, we have everything done there. Um, my computer is very loud, so sorry. That means we're halfway through our time limit. I just have to edit everything. I never realized how long 24 hours really was. I'm, just, I'm, I'm already tired. I'm already very tired and I don't plan on sleeping tonight. So we're gonna see how that goes. Um, we're gonna see uh, if this is a fruitful effort or not. We're halfway done, it's time to go. I took all the different clips and I color coded them so it would be easy to figure out what goes where and eventually all I had to do was put the pieces together. It's 3 a.m. right now, which means there's this much time left until we have to actually have this thing done for the for the premiere that we're doing. And so far, what I've done is I've actually taken everything and it's segmented by color um, so you know like what goes where. Um, and the problem with me uh, doing it like this is when we shot everything, we had it with the idea of all oh, like the, the mockumentary type stuff. It's gonna go in at random intervals to make things like kind of flow and make sense. The problem is we didn't script anything, so I have to figure out where the best place to put these things are and how to make them fit in with the actual stories. So that's gonna be fun. As the night continued and the hours passed by, I could slowly see myself slipping into Morbius madness as my tired brain clouded my judgment. So editing is going really well. It's 4 a.m. right now, which means there's this much time left, or this much time left, yeah. There's time. I've left over McDonald's, so I'm debating eating this Big Mac. It looks honestly pretty gross. I'm feeling hungry, and I'm at the, the point of tiredness where like my, my judgment is just completely off. So I'm probably gonna eat this Big Mac, and I will update with you with how that goes. The Big Mac did not sit well. Regret. Business is booming, we're progressing. Look at this, all the things that I had segmented out, I'm getting them through. There's a few more things left that I have to kind of squeeze in wherever, but we have everything pretty pretty close to being done. All right, it just hit 6 a.m. and I think we're done. I think we're complete. That means we actually, we actually did it faster than 24 hours, so I should probably sleep a little bit for the premiere event. With Forbius finally complete, I went to bed for about four hours before waking up for the premiere of my masterpiece. Hello everybody, and welcome to the 1215 premiere of Forbius, the greatest movie to ever be made. Some of you have been a part of this, this masterpiece, this, this magnum opus, this great piece of cinema. And today, we are going to, to watch it, because it's good. Yeah. Man, that shit was legit, dude. Played the fucking bats, dude. He's running in the fucking bats. That shit was so cool, bro. It's like, this is so fucking cool, dude. I'm doing, I'm doing society a service. Yeah. You know? Yeah, man. 
It's it's what uh, needs to be done. Again. What the? Oh oh oh! Jared went low. Morbius is absolute trash. Oh, you got You see, I've been investigating the morb. I've, I've had a, a few cases brought to me about, about the morb and the, the, the morb things that the morb does. And um, you see, these, these are lives in the line, you know? So as a detective, I want, I'm saving lives. I'm trying to figure out who this morb is and, and what they're morbing. The morb is sweeping across the nation and not the movie. The morb is a serial killer killing those who enjoy the movie Morbius. Now, why they do this is uncertain, but they are, are killing a lot of people, and that's not good. Here at the news, we do not like the morb, but you know what we do like? Morbius, a great movie. Oh, oh, it looks like the morb is actually actually here today. Uh, morb, what, what's, what's, oh, that's a, that's a, oh! My replacement tomorrow at eight. So, uh, Mr. or Mrs. The Morb, uh, why do you kill? Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a good question. Um, so I saw, I saw Morbius once. You know, it was um, an experience. Yeah, I, uh, I, I wanted to vomit five seconds into the movie, and then. I just have this utter rage because I, 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 you know, I yell out, "Fuck! This movie sucks!" You know, like as any person should watching that godforsaken film. You can call it a film. Um, and the person sitting next to me is like, you know, you know, it's not that bad. Like I'm actually kind of enjoying this. So I like pulled out my knife and I, I stabbed him. You know, like about 37 times. Because it's, it's not. They were lying. It's terrible. Bro, oh, this movie sucks! I think it's okay. Well, hi, I'm Cheryl. Hey, Cheryl. Okay. Um. I'm just a chick, you know? I'm just a. Just a. Just a person. I like knives. They're fun. I don't know. They're, they're shiny. They're fancy. Yeah. Chase and Jace are like my best friends. Pretty, pretty swag. We go to, we go get ice cream like every other Thursday. So that's my plan for today. Okay. How are you doing? Oh, I'm doing good. It's been hard since mom left. Yeah. So um, it's been, it's been a lot. Should have. You got any plans for the rest of the day? you know, um, behind all these, these murders. Uh, I personally, um, I'm not, I'm not a morbid, you know, you're just horrible. I'm still looking for the morb, though. Oh, that's a good Fortnite burger. Yeah, I mean, you sure really enjoyed it. Are you, have you seen, uh, Morbius yet? Uh, no, we were about to, uh, <laughs> Yeah. Actually. It looks pretty good. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. Hashtag Morbius first to get up four billion dollars in the Dude, oh my, like this is the best shit I've ever seen. All right, so I'm not sure if you can tell or not, but I'm kind of a big Sony fan. You know, the Sony games, the PlayStation, Sony pictures. I mean, they just put out consistently amazing work. I mean, have you seen this film, Into the Spider-Verse? That shit's crazy. It's so cool. Look at his vampire powers. We got the Carnage G Fuel, I'm a big fan. Anyways, I just could not say enough good things about this film. I mean, the pacing was perfect. Jared Leto was really trying in the role. I mean, he was doing so well. And his Morbin makeup? Oh, he looked so morbed up when he morbed. Don't they look so neat? That's fair. I'm not a man, but it's not bad. Morbius was mid. I know, right? And the, the, the uh, black guy, Michael Keaton was in it. 
The vulture showed up. That's crazy. It's not like that was in every commercial. He was there. I have never seen a better movie. More vicious, even. It was oh. really good. Like that part with the bats. Like we were just talking about that. that. Oh my gosh. Yeah, no, that bat scene was kind of cool. I don't know if Morbius was like my favorite movie of all time, but it's like right up there with another Sony Pictures classic, the Emoji Movie. Okay, um, I, I guess it's good you enjoyed it. Yeah, it's um, great. It's really quite a roller coaster. And that's, that's certainly what Morbius gave me. Do you want to smoke some drugs? Sure. I, you know, oh, I could so go on about this movie all night. Morbius! Yeah, I, yeah, no, I mean... I, th I think we should smoke some drugs. I definitely have some things. Yeah, I'd love to smoke some drugs. Okay, um, you guys have your drugs on you, right? Um, I don't know, I think I'm not sure. So I ran out of drugs yesterday, so I have to go to the store and grab myself some drugs. Oh, you have to go to the drugstore? Yeah, I have to ah, go to the drugstore. Okay. Um, so I guess I'll just like meet you in the woods where we usually are near our smoke spot. Yeah, yeah, just okay. in the woods. Yeah, I'll go talk to my pharmacist. Okay, cool. So you guys will go grab your drugs, I'll grab my drugs, and then we'll meet in the forest. Alright, yeah. Yeah, sounds good. Uh, Swag. Okay. We'll just see what's in the drugs. Let's go. Yeah. Alright. Okay, cool. See you soon. Yeah, see Hot on the trail. Finding things. Finding things, you know? Yeah. Oh, I almost got them. I almost got them. The thing about killing people and attacking people is that, like, me as an empath, it, it truly hurts more for me than for them. You know? Like, I'm oh my God. banging away with this dude, and it's just, I can feel it, like, I can, I can feel the hammer in my hands. I haven't seen it. And I can feel the hammer hitting me, because, like, I'm an empath, you know, so, yeah, it, it's kind of just, like, self-torture, I, you know, I don't know, I, probably the, like, the, the backlash I get for being an empath, you know. Welcome to Chipotle. Have you seen Morbius? It's Morbin time! Can't change it. It is what it is. Hey, Chase! Oh, Chase, what's up? I got the drug. Yo, that's sick. I check out my alcohol. Whoa! Where'd you get that? We're only 20. Dude, drugstore is crazy. Here, let's hit. Yeah. Cheers. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, I'm so alcohol right now. Whoa! Man, this is insane. Whoa, what was that? Whoa, was that a Whoa. deer? I think that's a deer. Whoa, that's a crazy deer. Oh, oh man. I'm, I'm gonna go check on the deer. Come here, dear. Oh shit. That's a crazy deer. Wait, wait a second. Oh no! The morb! <laughs> This morb, this morb's gonna get got. I solved the case. Ah! Chase, it's a detective. No! <laughs> no! Who could have done such a thing? Oh, the morph! Oh. Die, morph!
Morbius and Joyer! Morbius was mid! We're the same, bro. I am the more. I'm not the more. I don't know why everyone thinks it's me. Hey guys, I'm sorry it took so long. I got the drugs and the munchies. I'm the more. Chase is being weird. But anyways, I'm not the more. Like, I, 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 I like knives. That doesn't that doesn't incriminate me. I don't stab people. Not yet, at least. I don't know. Oh man, you're in for a treat when you go see Morbius. Only in theaters. After finishing my Morbster piece, I decided that since we were already dripped out, we might as well go see the original Morbius to pay homage to the classic that it is. We had not seen the movie, but were able to make a competent sequel regardless. However, this led to an argument between the Morb enthusiasts like myself. I mean, I mean, look at the look at the Morbius G Fuel. You gotta you gotta love it. Not sponsored, by the way. And the Morb deniers. But eventually we all agreed to see it. However, in our heated discussion, we wasted about an hour, meaning that we would be cutting it close to the showtime. And to top it all off, none of us had eaten yet. So we rushed to the theater which conveniently had a Burger King in the parking lot. Not my first choice, but it did the job. We have like 10 minutes to get our food and eat uh, at Burger King. Burger King. <laughs> hey, Burger King. Wrap it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my hands look. For my price. Yo, drink the ketchup. Make it your little juicy juice. I got my food early, so I was able to inhale it like Kirby in the restaurant, allowing me to drive us to the theater while everybody else ate in the car. Sean, speed, speed, finish that Burger King, finish those fries, finish the burger, we gotta watch Morbius. Ah! But soon we were finally able to see the movie in all of its glory. We have one ticket for Morbius. Oh, the Morbius. <laughs> We the Morbius Cup, Morbius Squad, Morb Gang. I really don't, I don't want to see this movie. In the past 24 hours, I heard the word Morb so many times that it lost what little meaning it already had. But finally, we were here. It was finally Morbin time. Morbius. Here we are. Morbius. Here we're at Morbius. Okay. We're going. We're going to Morbius right now. I think it's funny. We were. We are. Yeah. We we were like 20 minutes late, and we, we didn't miss any Morbing. We didn't. We didn't we, miss any Morbing at all. And we're still on the like the previews for the other movies. So we've missed the best part of the movie already. Yeah. But. <laughs> it's all downhill from here. It was a cinematic masterpiece. But you can't see it in theaters anymore, destroying the possibility for future Morb enthusiasts to see this movie as it's intended. They brought it back once, but as we all know, we were all busy that weekend. But with that being said, I hope to see you in the next one. Oh, and you can watch Forbius on its own on my old channel. Link's in the description as well, and probably right here somewhere if you want to watch it again. I don't know why you'd want to watch it again. Uh, I mean, it is a cinematic masterpiece, but you can do that if you want. It's probably here somewhere, unless I, it's on the other side. I don't know. Bye.